I like the ambition of the club. I had a phone call with the coach here and the direction the club's heading in is something that really appealed to me. Especially with them going full-time as well, I feel like I can develop at a faster rate than being in a part-time environment. And I know a couple of the boys, I've spoke to them for the last two days and they're all good lads. I feel like I could be in a good environment with good people that can help me develop as a player. So you've been part of the Broncos um, <coughs> set up sort of from a youngster and up until that point it's always been full-time. So what do you get from that environment and what are you hoping mm. that Thunder replicates? Yeah, uh, well I've got a lot of support from the coaches. They sit me down a lot to help me in terms of development. But then now, them going part-time, I feel like if I'm at a full-time environment, it'll be better. So from the coaches here, I just kind of want them to replicate in terms of sitting me down, talking to me, helping me develop and focusing on like the little details instead of you know, the big stuff, so I can get the little stuff right, yeah. So tell me a little bit about what was going on when we, we sort of came and got you. Um, I know that you've, uh, you were saying that so you took, spoke with, mm. with the head coach and sort of he spoke to your family as well, so tell yeah. me a little bit about what went on there. Yeah, I spoke to Freddie and then he obviously on the phone was telling me about the direction of the club. And then um, I just thought he was a nice lad. He called my mum and made sure that she was all right with me moving up because um, from London to Newcastle was a big move. So my mum was pretty happy that the coach had so much care and like for the family as well. And I just think, yeah, overall, he's just a nice guy. He's always around the boys, making sure everyone's happy and making sure you're good. He's, I've exchanged a lot of text messages with him. Just, he was just making sure I'm all right with the move up. I've got everything sorted, so, yeah. And how exciting is the prospect? I mean, you're a young lad, 22, mm -hmm. so you, you're just starting out on your career. Yeah. So how exciting is it to, to hopefully have a club that you can try and progress all the way through to the, to the top level with? Yeah, it's very exciting. Um, it's, it's something I want to be a part of Newcastle Thunder in terms of their goal to get Super League 2030. I want to be part of that, so I'm just going to work hard as possible now to make sure that I can build a name for myself on this team. Um, make a name for yourself, supporting the team. What's a, what are your individual targets for, for the coming season? What makes it a good year for you? I'm going to focus 100% on making sure I get the little details right and making sure I get around the boys as much as possible and just play for the boys on my right, boys on my left, to make sure that I'm trying my hardest year. And what sort of style of play have you got? What's, uh, what, what should we expect to see from you on the, uh, on the wings next year? Probably speed is probably my best attribute. I, heard that, I hear that a lot. Everyone says, oh, you're fast, but I could be faster. So, you know, work on it, but yeah, a lot of speed. That's what you can expect. I